Hey, how's it going, Stacy? This is Holden. I said I was going to send you over this video, and in this video, I just want to show you basically a few things that you can do to really beat out your competition online and get some more customers in the door. Uh, everybody is really searching for what they want in Google online these days, right? And if you're not getting found in the search results, then you're really just missing out on a lot of customers that are out there potentially looking for you. And a lot of times, I find that the only hesitation that business owners have to hiring someone for this sort of thing is they don't really know who the experts are and who they're not. So I found by giving out this free plan of attack, you know, these, these three things that you can do and implement yourself has really resulted in a lot of business owners coming back to me and saying, hey, Holden, I could really use your help. So if by the end of this video, you feel like I've got some value and you want to chat, shoot me a message and we'll definitely talk. If not, that's totally fine too. I just uh, ask that you do implement these things. They'll definitely help your business out and get you some more customers. So let's jump in. I got your website pulled up. Now, when it comes to Google optimization, the first thing they look at is content. They want to see about 1,500 words of content alone on your homepage just to be optimized. Uh, this is a tool I have called SEO Quake. It's free. You can pick it up yourself. It just pulls some metrics off your page, but it shows me you've got about 700 words of content. So you're falling short of that 1,500 that Google really likes for optimization right there. So that's something you could easily do to boost your, your uh, visibility in Google. Now, I searched for for installation Boise, Idaho, right? This is considered a keyword. This is anything that someone searches for in this bar up here is a keyword, right? And you wanna include the keywords that people are searching for in the content on your homepage. Google wants to match what people are searching for with the most relevant content out there. And if that's not on your homepage and the content, they're gonna to go to the next guy. Um, and the next thing I wanna show you is this right here. This is called the local map pack. This is how you get found locally in your area for things like near me, by me, Boise, you know, wherever you guys service, if you want to get found in those areas, the way you do that is by getting your name, address, and phone number out there as many times as possible into as many directories as possible. That's things like Yellow Pages, Facebook, Yelp. If your competition has 50 of these things, make sure you're going and getting 150. That way you can sit up here at the top and collect the local traffic and you don't have to drive across the state to go, you know, do a set, right? And uh, that, that's important. You want to make sure that you're getting local traffic. Now down here, this is called the organics area. This is where most people will click after the the map pack up here and to get in the organics you got to look at at basically google like a popularity contest there's all these things called backlinks out there which are are basically popularity votes the more of these links you have coming from other websites to your website pointing in your direction the more popular your website seems to google and they start boosting you up in these rankings but not all backlinks are created equal you need to make sure you're finding backlinks that have to do with installation right can't be a pizza shop linking to an insulation shop. Google will recognize there's no correlation between the two and they'll start deducting you points. So I'm gonna show you this over here. This is a, a tool that I pay about $1,000 a month for. It buys data directly from Google. It's not perfect, but it does give me a really good idea of what's going on with your website as far as the reason that you're getting the traffic that you are, right? So right now it shows me that you're getting about six people to your website organically a month. That you have 117 keywords that people are searching for and you have only one of those websites linking back to your website one time. So this is probably where you're lacking most. Um, and this shows me your domain rank and your URL rank. This is kind of the quantity of these links that you have and then the quality of those links because I said they're not all created equal. So it's just showing me that you have really low quality um, and you could easily boost that up and that would definitely get you some more traffic. This guy over here, he's your, your biggest compensation out there in in Idaho, right? You can see he gets about 600 or 156 people to his website organically a month. And he's got 656 keywords that people are searching for to find him. And additionally, he's got 38 of those websites linking back to his website, giving him a pretty low domain rank score. So I would say that a lot of these backlinks are not very powerful. They're not relative to insulation. And that's why he's getting a low domain rank score. Because once again, this shows me the quantity of links that he has. He has a lot of them but they're low quality, right? So just to reiterate, the three things I want you to take a look at are content, 1500 words at least, making sure that you get all those keywords in there that people are searching for in the search bar. Additionally, if you wanna get found in that local map pack, make sure you're getting your name, address, and phone number out there as many times as possible into as many directories as possible, things like yellow pages. And finally, if you want to get found in the organics and get that, that traffic that's coming in over here, you know, these 
start stealing this 156 organic traffic that this guy's getting. You need to get your backlinks up and we need to beat this guy out uh, for the amount of backlinks and the quality of the backlinks that he has. And that'll really boost you up in the organic search results and you can start collecting some of that traffic. So I hope this was helpful. And like I said, if you'd like to chat, shoot me a message and we'll definitely do that. If not, totally cool as well. Uh, I just ask if you do not mind, would you please send me an email back whether you're interested or not and let me know what you thought of the video. I'd love the feedback and I'd really appreciate it. All right. Thanks a lot. Have a good one.